Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing a video inside Minecraft PE Windows 10. So, here we have a. So, this is going to be a tutorial on the redstone passcode lock. So, you can just flick the levers like this, and the door opens. There's a. And there's. It's pretty easy with redstone behind it so if we switch it all off it should if you flick one it closes and all the redstone still works and everything is good so we can just zoom over to another place to start off this episode and let's get started so first you're going to start off by a 3 by 3 tower like this and you're going to get another block for decoration. You're going to place it in by three. You can do whatever design you want, but I'm only doing this because of the video's sake, so yeah. And place it like that. Alright, so now next, and before actually doing that, you're going to have to um, make it like you're going to, for like a normal house if you have like single door you can you need to place down your door and after that you're going to place down your levers so you go to the levers and want to make sure you leave a middle gap here so yeah. So after you've done that, you're gonna label. We can get to this step a bit later, but we're going to. Whoops. You're going to have to um, if you want to, label your signs. But I'm not going to because I have other stuff to do. So sorry about that, guys. But you can label it if you want. So the next thing you're going to do is build a little platform here. So just place it here. And place it like that. Alright. So after that you're going to get your redstone torch and place it where at the top row you're going to place it where you want your passcode to be. So what I mean, say I'm going to do in, in an upside down T shape. So this lever and these three levers at the bottom. You're going to have to um, place your redstone torch here and then come down. And then place all redstone torches here so it's in an upside down to you so you get the idea so you have to put the redstone torch in the pattern of the levers so you can get it in so now for the redstone the redstone is actually very simple surprisingly so going to get redstone dust And you're going to place it around the redstone so you don't actually want it to be inside there and then you're going to um, get a block and place it down so the redstone can actually trace it in so it comes down into a trail so it actually connects up with the bottom two so this actually gives you the opportunity to and then you're going to place down your redstone torches and then you're going to make a trail and break these few blocks 
Now you're going to have to break down the block where it's supporting the iron door so that can just pop out. And you're going to break these three blocks. Now, you're going to... Whoops. The block there. You're going to have to have a... The redstone coming down to here. The next step is that um, you place the block there and then get a redstone torch, place it there so it's turned off. And after that, you're going to place a block of above and then place down your iron door and then do your little combination lock. So mine's the upside down T. And voila, you've finished your combination lock. Thanks for watching, subscribe, like and comment for more videos like this. And I may start a multiplayer gameplay series. And yeah, thanks for watching and bye.